professional decision making for the project manager. 9. Here is the project scenario. You are the Scrum Master for a Scrum or Agile project developing a complex product. Suddenly, you get a call from the product owner expressing his inability to attend the sprint or iteration planning meeting, which is already scheduled. How will you handle the situation? I'll read it once again. You are the Scrum Master for a Scrum or Agile project developing a complex product. Suddenly, you get a call from the product owner expressing his inability to attend the sprint or the iteration planning meeting, which is already scheduled. How will you handle the situation? The options go ahead with the meeting as planned, cancel the meeting, identify the next best time for the meeting and schedule it, try to do the meeting as planned with the reduced duration and send the minutes of the meeting for approval. The options again, go ahead with the meeting as planned, cancel the meeting, identify the next best time for the meeting and schedule it, try to do the meeting as planned with a reduced duration and send the minutes of the meeting for approval. So here, uh, which one is the right answer? Uh, go ahead with the meeting as planned uh, will not help because it is the, the product owner's presence is very, very important uh, because he has to prioritize the features. He has to clarify the questions uh, by the team. Uh, only after that, the team will be able to estimate uh, the features during the planning meeting. So in his going ahead with the meeting as planned, uh, will not be effective. So the first one is ruled out. Cancel the meeting. Yes, maybe. Uh, but then we have this urgency part. If I cancel the meeting, it will have an impact on the schedule. So the urgency part of the project is sacrificed by just by blindly canceling the meeting. Identify the next best time for the meeting and schedule it possible and that is the easiest. Try to do the meeting as planned with a reduced duration and send the minutes of the meeting for approval. Uh, that will be undermining the effectiveness of the process itself. So it will become like a, a formality, a reduced duration. So again, Scrum Master is the product owner's availability is not there. So the fourth one is not very different from uh, the first one. Uh, can be the if the fourth one is worse than the first one. So this is not the right answer. So of the given options we have, identify the next best time for the meeting and schedule it. That is the that is the easiest, straightforward, and the most appropriate action without sacrificing the urgency part uh, and the ethics part. Uh, because I cannot, I cannot plan something in the absence of the owner, especially when the features are decided. So that becomes unethical, that becomes uh, sometimes unprofessional, so the best thing is identify the next best time for the meeting and schedule it. So here is the uh, Scrum framework. Uh, for those of you for whom Scrum is very new, so this is the Scrum environment. 
where the product owner maintains the product backlog uh, and we get into a sprint or an iteration uh, it starts with the sprint planning meeting where the team and the product owner decides what are things they will do during the sprint and uh, and the work is executed by the self organizing team or the development team and every day there is a daily scrum or a daily stand up meeting to review the progress at the end of the sprint there is a sprint review meeting and a sprint retrospective and the product increment is created and uh, and this cycle continues uh, till the complete product backlog is built so that is scrum in a nutshell uh if you have not subscribed to pmri campus channel yet please do subscribe so that you will not miss out on any of the updates thank you very much